Ah, welcome back, everybody. Round three for the evening. Final round. Everything that ended tonight, guys. Everything that ended Friday and Saturday, we already did. It is already up on YouTube and the website if you guys want to go check it out, if you missed anything by chance. Other than that, welcome to Right Out Sports, everybody. Got a lot to come tonight. I'm going to start with some 20. Uh, actually, we got two options still ending. Um, right now, we are just starting up the 15 diamond. Last break of that we did, we pulled two legend autos and a one of one. We've probably seen four one of ones out of there. Out of 11 breaks, I'm going to say at least $1,000 hits, maybe more. I mean, we've pulled some monster hits out of there so far. One of one. <laughs> Yeah, that's a good tag, I gotta say. That's what you call a true one of one. All right, guys. We're gonna start with some 15 Inception. We got some 15 Strata two box break. Some 13 Playbook, which we haven't done for a while. Some 16 Bowman Inception baseball. First break, we did pull a Kyle Schwaber. Uh, there's some other names we may have pulled that were good. I'm not 100. I'm only know some of these names so far. I still got a little bit to learn about some of them. 11 plates, 13 triple threads, some 15 lux. We got some more black gold. A TriStar autograph miniature helmet. A Hit Parade Series 5 baseball jersey. A basketball jersey. Some 09 upper deck black. Last one we get to do, honestly. Uh, it's a great set. A lot of uh, there is no card in 09 black that is worth under $12 Beckett value. Not one single card. Uh, Hit Parade Series 7 baseball jer football jersey. The 11 Prime Six, which ended a few minutes ago. That was cool, Caldale. I got to say, man, that was pretty awesome. Uh, game Day Greats jersey with some 14 playbook. Some Tops Diamond, which is ending right now. And the Full Size Helmet, which will end here in about 30 minutes. We'll do at the end of the video. A lot to come tonight. <clears throat> I always look forward to doing 09 Black. I mean, we've seen gold signing Peyton Manning's come out of there. We've seen gold signing um, Emmett Smith's out of one of the recent ones we did. We've only done nine of these breaks and pulled some monster hits at them. To be honest, though, the last two haven't been that big. Uh, so we're due for a big one. Last two have been mainly rookies. And no big legend hits. Though the, the American flag patch cards we got were all great names. We got the Barry Sanders. And someone else, can't remember the life of me the other one was, but it was another huge name. But we've seen some great hits tonight already, a couple of 101s. <clears throat> the triple autograph of Big Ben, Eli Manning, and Drew Brees. We saw a Drew Brees jersey. We saw a Jim Kelly jersey. We've seen some great hits tonight. We'll start with some 15 Inception number 127. <clears throat> Again, guys, this ended early, early this afternoon. <clears throat> we got Pad or Pa Dil Frey up top. Matt, welcome to us, I believe. Max Power. Stone Stash, how's it going, sir? Dallas, Midnight, Dempitch, Stone Stash. Uh, I'm still trying to get eBay names with. Uh, YouTube names, Upstate Treasures, right? <clears throat> I think. Dallas, Midnight, J uh, Jer Crow 100, Paddle of Frey, Co Back Bar, Starburst again with the Saints, Sargon, good to see you, sir. <clears throat> P. Michael, Steeler Gal, Skywalker with the Chargers. I'm going to see Nuno tonight, Skywalker, where the heck is he? And West Virginia on the bottom. Ah, see, my memory's a little better than I thought it was. Like Brad earlier, I had no idea that was you were sleeping giant. 15 Inception, guys. It is one pack per box, three hits, usually two autographs and a relic card of some sort. Uh, did you bid into anything today, Mathis? 
anything on Sunday. Everything, if you bid it only into Fridays and Saturdays, yeah, everything's been done. Oh, we pulled you a few hits. All right, let's get it going with old Patrick Willis to start off. Retired. His career didn't last that long, to be honest. I mean, he came out in 07, retired in last year in 14, so seven-year career and done. Shady. Ah, uh, first Sankey sighting of the night to 50, thank God. Well, at least it was uh, our 29th break-in for the evening before we saw Sankey. He broke Bortles to 99. First off, will be a Sammy Coates for the Steelers. Steeler gal. Be an on-card rookie auto. I haven't seen much of all Coates yet. The Friday breaks were the ones at 7. Uh, if you go to writeoutsports.com or just go to our channel here at YouTube, you'll see the way we list the auctions is breaks ending Friday, breaks ending Saturday, breaks ending Sunday as well. And we also have the schedule up there too. So I've got a Leonard Williams to 25. First of the print run on card. But what we always do is um, we always have the schedule up top so you can see the order they ended in. And that way you can just scroll to the video you're in. And a Doriel Green Beckham for the Titans. Be a rookie to 125 two color relic. Very good start to the night stuff. I hold some awesome, awesome hits. Two Drew Brees autographs in one night is rare. Yeah, uh, I know, <clears throat> Mathis. We picked. We I know we hit pull some hits for you. Uh, I know the Monty Ball, and then there was a Peyton Manning triple patch as well. The Monty Ball was an autograph, on card autograph from 13 Black and 14 Limited was a Peyton Manning triple. All right, fellas, that was 2015 Inception. All right, guys, up next we'll move to some 15 Strata. Don't do a lot of Strata, but it is a beautiful set. Nah, I wish it was a dirty Peyton patch, but no. <laughs> no, unfortunately not. They're never dirty. He never got hit. Yeah, that's true. He doesn't go down often. Got a 15 top strata. There's a two box break, number 21. We got Dem Pitch up top, Jer Crow, Boys Life, Lord Villa, Cough Dog, Mimsical, Bats. Dan Pitch, Skywalker, The Box, Score, Wyatt, Hall, Delbert, May, Mark Stagg, Bone Sports Cards, Krista, The Box, Score, I Love Chrissy, 2, RDKOH, and Ross. Yeah, Monty Ball's not going to be worth much anymore. So much was expected of that boy, and he just did not come through. All right, 15 Strata, fellas. Guys, you get two hits per box. Start with old Devin Funches to 99. Big boy for the Panthers, Lord Villa. As always, you get the nice spacer in between the cards to keep them separated and getting from getting scratched. And a Jamison Crowder on card rookie autograph jumbo relic for the skins. Rouse 95. All 
right, box number two, guys. Did we get three hits? That never... Did we get three? No, we did not. We got a shadow box on card autograph of Jeremy Langford. Look at the thickness of this card. Insanely thick. It's like three cards in one. On card autograph to 150 for the Bears. Cough dog. Followed by a Tyler Lockett on card autograph for the old Seahawks. And the I Love Chrissy too. Welcome to us, I believe. Nice hit on the great special uh, teams guy for the Seahawks. You returned two, three, might be more. I think it was at least, I uh, know it was at least two touchdowns from returns last year. I don't know if it was any more than that. It may have been. I'll tell you one thing, the Seahawks are going to do anything this year. They better hope they fix that offensive line. What a joke that was last year. Half, I think they even had a couple guys that uh, didn't even really start. Yeah, Russell Wilson doesn't run because he chooses to. He runs because he has to. Yeah, unlike Cam. Next, guys. We have some 13 playbook here in a minute. And we have another baseball break. Our first break of 16 Bowman Inception was very nice. Uh, again, it is uh, Inception in baseball is different than in football. You get five total autos, one of them at least being an autograph relic as well. All right, fellas, on to some 13 playbook number 152. This guy's again ended Sunday, early afternoon. Shady, there you are, Stone Stash, the Falcons Poker King. I see what you are. Are you a Falcons fan? I see with them quite often. Okay, cool, Dave. David. Yeah, it's uh you that's like another great thing about streaming off of YouTube. You can pretty well watch pretty much watch on anything without ads as well. Again, with breakers you have ads galore. You can really really only watch on computers. So a whole other monster. We got Shady76, Lord Villa again, Chris Gimple, Skywalker, Samway. No, no, Ral, not at all. Uh, Diamond is just ending right this moment. It's still not over yet. We'll get that started. That'll be towards the end of the video. That's a few breaks out still. Actually, quite a bit of breaks out still. Mark Stagg, Dem Pitch, R. Palmer, Zargon, Core Balking, Chris Gimple, Samway, and Gimple on the bottom. You go back before 14 with playbook. It's four total hits per box. 13 is the one year that guarantees you two booklets. It is two booklet hits, then two other hits. All right. One pack. There's our another booklet. Did we get three, or is just one a very thick pack? Ah, uh, I wonder if that's the mystery base card pack we haven't seen in forever. In 13, oddly enough, they actually have base cards. 
You don't see them very often. It's like one out of every four boxes. It'd probably take forever to pull, to do a whole set. Yeah, we did pull the Kelly earlier. Skywalker. All right, guys, let's get it going. Well, it's a great way to start when you pull Le'Veon Bell rookie autograph to 25. Kiss my Zargon. Nice hit. Great way to start it. I'm sure that's who you were going for. All right, fellas. After that, we don't have a base card. We got a redemption with, we got an extra hit to 99 Alex Okafor, Shady 76. Oh. Oh, 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 oh. Playbook Signature Platinum, Andrew Luck. Oh, that is a big boom for the Colts and Chris Gimple. 82, I believe. Welcome to us. What a hit. Uh, no, in the video, I, I, try, I, I, can, I try to state it as much as I could so people would catch it. Uh, the 12 black, for some odd reason, we had a shipping delay. I don't know if they gave us an... I think they might have given us an extra 13 by mistake when we ordered it because 13 black and 12 black look pretty darn similar. And I think they sent us an extra 13 instead of the 12. So we're getting that fixed. It'll be here. Uh, we'll get that done Tuesday at the latest. Uh, we'll throw in an extra hit, too, for it, Vicky, because uh, for the delay, we always put in a nice hit if we ever delayed a break. Awesome hit on an Andrew Luck. All right, behind that, kind of my hurts hurts for Philly. So be a rookie, dual patch. Another good thing about thirteen playbook to two ninety nine is even their higher number of hits have some great swatches on them. Old hurts hurts. Yeah, sorry about that, Vicky. And old Andre Ellington for the Colts. Shady 76. This will be the old napkin relic jumbo booklet to 199. What an Andrew Luck. Woo! Signature platinum. Awesome hit on old Andrew Luck. Seen a lot of luck autos lately. Now, I mean, there's been points where we went a while without seeing an Andrew Luck, and then all of a sudden, bam, we've seen, I think, four of them. Well, actually, more than that in the last couple of weeks. There's been a lot of Andrew Luck autos. All right, guys, we'll move to baseball here in a minute. We got some 16 Bowman Inception. Then we're on to some 11 plates. Followed by some 13 triple threads, some 15 luck, some 14 black gold, a mini helmet, a baseball jersey, a basketball jersey, some 09 black, a Hit Parade Series 7 jersey, some 11 prime signatures. A game day great jersey, then the diamond that's ending now, and then the full size helmet, which is about to start up in the next 10 or 15 minutes. Six. Uh, the diamond is ending now, though. We have been on fire with that set. We have pulled so many big time hits out of there. This will be number two, guys. Hit uh, Bowman Inception Baseball. It's ended Sunday. We got Hall, Dempitch, War Eagle, Ravens, P. Michael, Kane, Dot Ski, Franabin, <coughs> R. Palmer, <coughs> Argonaut, P. Michael, Matthew James, R. Berg, Samway, T. X. Sancho, Argonaut, and P. Michael on the bottom. All right, beautiful look to Inception in 16. I actually like the look of it better than I did in 15. It has a, just a, I don't know, more color to it, I guess you would say. Not the best way to put it. 
Most autographs are on card, guys. A little different than football. It's one pack per box, but you get five autographs. At least, uh, usually one autograph relic as well. All right, a beautiful look to Inception this year. We got an Aaron Judge for the Yankees on card autograph to start off. One, two, three, P. Followed by an Anderson Espinosa for the De uh, for the old Red Sox. One, two, three, P. Another on card auto. <clears throat> Most are on card except for every once in a while with your autograph patches. I think a lot of those are stickers. Bu Bureaus to 150 for the Tigers. R. Palmer 82. Nice on card autograph. Found by Franklin Kilnome for Philly. R. Berg. And finally, an Orlando Arcia for the Milwaukee Brewers rookie autograph relic. Ross K. Doctor 13. Nice hit, sir. We'll be doing some more Bowman baseball, too, guys. It's a great set to get your prospects in. A lot of your younger guys as well. Uh, Beckett values are not out on them yet. Hmm. Oh, they popped out? Okay, they weren't out the other day. They must have popped up now. Uh, Saturday, they weren't, they, Saturday they weren't out. They must have popped them up. Or Friday. Friday or Saturday they weren't out. They must have popped them out uh, over the weekend. It usually takes about two weeks when a set comes out to actually get the prices up on there. All right, guys. We'll do some 11 plates here in a moment. Then on to some 13 triple threads. Yeah, guys, people are asking about fantasy leagues. We will be doing those again this year. Um, again, it will be people that played last year get first dibs on the freebie leagues. Uh, seniority will get first dibs on the on the buy, on the the money league. Again, freebie leagues, guys, it's not just for fun. We do give prizes out at the end of the year. We do like a big mixer break for everybody that won for like top four spots in the league. Uh, the money league, though, we have not decided. We're actually going to figure that out. We're thinking about a, about a hundred dollar buy-in on them, and we're not going to do it for money. We'll do it for like um, a box of flawless, or and we'll put our we'll put our hundred dollars to it. And we're not the breakers that try to just take money and roll with it. Me and Robbie will play. We'll put our hundred bucks into it as well. Uh, we'll either do flawless. We could do a few boxes like immaculate national treasures and diamond in a three box break. Or we could just do one box of Flawless. I mean, there's many different variations we could do as well. I mean, it's all kind of stuff you could do. You could do like friggin' nine, from maybe nine boxes of triple, eight or nine boxes of triple threads. If you really want to get down and dirty, you could do like nine boxes of Spectra. But I mean, we'll, we'll pull it out to see what everybody wants to do. You could do 40 boxes of Bone Chrome if y'all want. 40 boxes of Bone. That, that break would take how many hours? We just take a week off. Yeah. <laughs> Be breaking for like a 15 hour period with Bowman Chrome. Good news is, at least we get 40 hits. Ooh. 11 plates and patches, number 138 up next, guys. This again ended today on eBay. See, anybody interested in fantasy leagues, there we're not short of spots. We do like three freebie leagues. It's either going to be two or three. We did three last year, but since we're going to be doing the money league, I don't know if I can run four leagues at once. I can try. That might be difficult. Uh, all right, we got Dallas up top next. Poker King Midnight. The only thing we do ask guys, like I, I, I always say this because I hate when people do it. Uh, if you do join a fantasy league, even if it's a free one, please, please play the whole season. I don't, I don't care if you're on a losing streak. I don't care if you're, you know, one in five. Still play. It doesn't take but five minutes to set a roster. Set your roster, even if you are on a losing streak, just because it makes it still fair for everyone else playing. 
I had two people last year that just quit playing on me because they weren't doing well. So I actually had to block them out and I had to take over their team, which is not, that's not fun. You don't have to do that. We got Dallas, Ants, Dad, West Virginia, Core Balking, 04 Trib, and looking for Turkey on the bottom. And how many of you guys have seen, I mean, I'm sure anybody who's played fantasy has come across that. We're like you're. You need to try to get your. You need a win to get in the playoffs, and then the guy that you need to lose ends up playing a team that has half the people not even starting. I'm sure we've all been there. The eleven plates, guys. It is uh, three autographs, one memorabilia hit, and then another autograph or memorabilia card. So there's five total hits. Base cards are low numbered, only to two ninety nine. One of those hits is usually an on card rookie autograph. You can get cut signatures out of here. We have pulled some monsters over the time we've done this set. Do very well with 10 as well. All right. Pulled a cut signature of Joe Perry the other day out of 10. Uh, there are cut signatures of Walter Payton in 10. I'm not sure about 11. I don't want to say there are and be wrong. So I'll just say there might be, because I'm not I'm not 100% sure. I know there are in 10, though. Got a rookie blitz, Leonard Hankerson. These are the 249 guys. All right, behind that, on to some base cards. Got a Steve Smith. Will he come back this year? He was planning on retiring last year, but he got hurt. Didn't get to finish his career like he wanted to. Base cards are always to 299. Got a parallel of Montario Harsty for the Brownies. These are usually low numbered. Two of ten. Looking for Turkey. Followed by Kyle Adams for the Bears. 48 of a hundred. On to a Doug Baldwin gold. 04 Trib. That will be 6 of 50. Our first hit is usually the rookie on-card autograph, Patrick. This time it's not. It's a Jared Mayo auto for the Patriots. Ant's dad, nice hit. Great linebacker for him. He's just been hurt a few times over his career. 8 of 25. Chimini Chekwa. Chekwa. Chimini Chekwa. Rookie auto for the Raiders. Looking for Turkey. Chimidi Chekwa to 199. Followed by Devin Hester. Looks like we might get an extra hit, too. <clears throat> this will be to 150. Followed by D'Angelo Williams for the Panthers. <coughs> Excuse me, guys. Lord Villa. That will be 299. And then a redemption number 235. We'll get to that after the last hit. Oh, Steven Jackson Reebok tag for the Rams. This will be low number. Dallas, one of five. Awesome, awesome hit on a one of five Steven Jackson Reebok logo. Precursors to your Nike swooshes. This Reebok did have the contract for jerseys for a very long time. Uh, since the early 2000s. 235. All right, guys, let's find out who 235 is. There's 235 is Belial Pal. And 234 is Belial Pal. 235 is Jamie Harper for the Titans. Looking for Turkey, that is you, sir. Again, guys, with Panini Redemptions. They may be expired, but you can still redeem them. I, we've really never had many issues with redemptions with Panini. Now, sometimes they will take a while. Uh, OBJ redemptions took forever to get back, but we finally did get some back recently, as well as a few of the people that break with us actually messaged me and said, hey, I got my OBJ redemption right about the same time I got it mine. Thirteen triple threads number one sixty nine is next, guys. 
We got Den Pitch up top, Dallas X Poker King, Nicolema, Lord Villa, Midnight, Mojo Riser, 04 Trib, Dallas, <coughs> Walter Ego, 66 with the Brownies. <coughs> Excuse me, guys. Gino Brown, welcome back. Our Palmer, Rodney's Gems, Dallas. Red Dog, Steeler Gal, Core Balking, Rodney's Gems, 04 Trib, and Rodney's Gems on the bottom. 13 Triple Threads. Some of the things we've seen come out of here from booklets with multi signs from the likes of Elway. <clears throat> this is all on one card Elway, Marino, Montana, Smith, Sanders, and Eric Dickerson. We've also seen an Eric Dickerson, Marshall Falk AP. We have also seen um, Jerry Rice, Steve Young, and Joe Montana on triple autos. It's a lot that we have pulled out of tri 13 triple threads. We do all years of triple threads. I pulled the monster hits out of, mo out of every year. But we've done, I think we've done more 13 than most other years. As you can see, number, 130, um, number 169. Pack's giving me a hard time here, guys. All right. Per mini box, you get two hits, a booklet. I'm oh, no, sorry, not booklet. I'm thinking playbook. You get one autograph relic and then a relic card of some sort, plus two parallels. We'll start with Frank the Tank to 170. Oh, my old Jake Locker to 320 now retired. Antonio Brown, C.J. Spiller, or Reggie Wayne. First hit will be a triple. Another triple. Second triple for the Rams tonight. Actually, third triple for the Rams tonight. Sam Bradford, Tavon Austin, Stedman Bailey, Red Dog Martin to 27. And a Justin Hunter rookie autograph patch for the Titans. All right, guys, mini box number two. Be our triple patch rookie auto, along with another hit. Start with a sacker pick to 25. Great low number parallel, although it is sacker pick. Cool breeze to 320. Lawrence Taylor. Oh, lefty. Patrick Peterson. A DeAndre to 75. Nice hit for the Texans. R. Palmer. And then the other Tampa Bay QB, Mike Glennon, three triple patch rookie autographs to 99 for the Bucks. So for Trib. All right, guys, that was 13 triple threads. This is the last triple threads we're doing tonight. We already did 14, 15, and 10, and just 13 a moment ago. So did a bunch of years of triple threads already this evening. Pulled a 101 out of one of them. All right, guys, we got some 15 Lux up next, followed by some black gold, a TriStar mini helmet. But right now we're actually ending a full-size helmet, so check that one out, guys. That'll be the last break of the evening. It'll be going for the next uh, 25 minutes or so. 
And then that will be it for the night, guys. That'll be the last break we break in this video. Fifteen Panini Lux number twenty-five, guys. We got Dem Pitch up top, Duff Man, X Poker King, Mad Mike, Rodney's Gems, Dallas, CDM, Brewski. Good to see you, sir. Mudfish, you as well. P Michael as well. A lot of our long timers in the Lux break tonight. Wyatt, Rodney's Gems, Dem Pitch, RDKOH, and Duff Man. Looks like all uh, guys have been with us for a while. Poker King, I believe you've been with us for a little bit, but still kind of new to us. Mad Mike, I believe you've been with us for a while. Our Palmer, I believe you're kind of new as well. But a lot of long timers in this Lux break. Guys, with Lux, as always, it is one pack per box. First year Lux came out for football. It's been out other years for basketball, but first year of football was 15. It's one pack per box. You get three on-card autos plus a hit of some sort. Not a hit of some sort, or a relic of some sort. All right. Usually two of your on-card autographs are going to be your metal frame cards as well. Redemption up top for a Devante Parker. Which will be a Dolphin. Rookie member B autographs prime gold. Miami. One, two, three, P. Uh, and that got a Sammy Coates on card rookie auto to 99. And a Vince Melee rookie on-card autograph to 99. Again, got an extra hit. Start with a Duke Johnson to 49. This guy's in for a good season as well again. Rodney's Gems. And another guy that's up and coming this year as well. Uh, Kevin White was actually hurt last year in his rookie season. It was supposed to be one heck of a wideout to 49 for the Bears. All Palmer 82. Yeah, if you're going to draft a wide out, Kevin might, White might be a good one, though. He's, it's already shown he's kind of injury prone, so. An interesting year this year come football season. A lot of teams are not going to do what the heck they did last, but that's every football season. You have teams just pop out of nowhere. Great teams fall to nothing. Sorry, Broncos fans. Things aren't looking all too hot for you at the moment. But your D may still be pretty good. Your offense is not going to be. Well, your offense wasn't even that good last year, but somehow you still won the Super Bowl. All right, guys, here in a minute we'll move to some 14 black gold. And check out the full-size helmet ending on eBay right now. It is in, it's still in the beginning stages of it, probably only about seven or eight teams through. All right, guys, 14 Panini black gold, number 156. This guy's again ended Sunday. Eh, right around the time we started breaking, actually. It's the second break in when we started breaking. Ah, DMP with his brownies. P. Michael with the Bills and the Bears. Poker King back again with those uh, Ravens. Another Ravens fan in the house. Dallas with Dallas, Caldwell with Denver, 123P, Rodney's Gems, Tommy Chapin. And guys, 14 is the first year of Black Gold. Uh, you will see us do a lot of 14. It is a great set. There is no card worth under $6. You can get your 14 karat gold cards. Some beautiful, massive material autos. There's the swatches with the autograph are usually the size of the card almost. Uh, every card is pretty much shadow box. They all have um, a very thick point to them, very thick cards. The reason we will not do 15 is this set was not built the same as 14. A lot of the team symbol cards actually move around in the card. 
Uh, you don't get the 14 karat gold cards with them. The values aren't the same in 15 black gold. So 14 will do as much as possible. We're not doing 15 anymore. I mean, unless someone really begs us to do it, I think we are done with it. Broncos still in the playoffs. Uh, you know, it, it, if it was a different division, I would say yeah. But considering the Chiefs still have a shot, the Raiders are up and coming, and the Chargers are rebuilding for the most part. I don't think the Chargers are going to do anything. But uh, Raiders, Chiefs, it's it's up for grabs. I mean, yeah, you know, the Broncos will, may make the playoffs, but I'm not going to say they're going to get it with a division win. I still, I still think, honestly, in my opinion, I think Raiders are going to come through this year. I said it last year that I really thought they were going to pop out, and they did okay. But I really think this year they're really going to improve. Is Amari Cooper's rookie year? I mean, second year. It's Derek Carr's third year. Khalil Mack was a monster last year. So Raiders, you better watch out for. Don't be wrong, the Broncos are my second team. Uh, I mean, I, they never were until Brian Dawkins went there. When Philly lost him and he went to Denver, I started going for Denver because he was playing for them. I just I just feel the Raiders are on the upswing. I really feel the Raiders are on the upswing. Andy Reid, his playoff, his playoff records as a coach speak for themselves. Or playoff appearances as a coach also speak for themselves. Well, the Raiders' curse is gone. Al Davis is, is no longer with them. That curse should be over at this point. Not a Raiders fan. Not a not a Chiefs fan. It's just it's just that's just my opinion on. It. I just think they have a very good show. Oh wow! I saw something cool in the back. I don't know what it is or who it is. I just saw a, a little something. One forty nine Forte. Team symbols. T Sizzle. Base card. Remember, guys, no card in this set is worth under $6. I don't care who it is. Beckett value doesn't matter who. So Terrell Suggs, if it's a... Latavius Murray, I thought he was going to be good. He just... He didn't really impress me last year. Ah, see, Pat, I knew you'd weigh in in the Raiders pretty soon. I thought that was coming. Oh yeah, Dawkins was a beast, man. And he was a monster. And he could do everything. He'd blitz you, he'd intercept you, he'd knock you down. He'd, he'd knock you the uh, straight out. He knocked uh Vic out one time. I saw him knock Crumpler out. I seen him knock a few players out cold. Got a Sean Green Bishop Sankey, I'm sorry. Bill Carso. Golden opportunities, which neither of them took to 149. To me, Sean Green is one of the worst running backs I've ever seen. And a Kadeem carry for the Bears. One, two, three, P. How about a one of one NFL Shield rookie auto? That's what I saw. I saw the Shield sticking out there. Awesome hit. Another one of one for the night. Nice hit, P. Michael. I was watching. I saw they had a P. Michael. You'd appreciate this. They had a uh, Kenny Stabler. I think thirty for thirty last night or the other night. They had on on the NFL Network. He was no longer with us. I never knew he was a Bama boy. I did not know that. All right, guys. Box number, or, sorry, pack number two. We'll start out oh, with another Sankey sighting to 149. If I buy a team symbols, Cecil Shorts to 149. Yeah, I think, like you just said, they're getting tight as a group. I think the Raiders are really going to pop out this year. Got a Russell Wilson for the Seahawks. Again, I said it last year, too. It didn't happen. It's a 99. Nice parallel little Russell. Pulled his uh, rookie booklet earlier. Got a Jadavion Clowney for the Texans. First pick of the draft, Bill Carso. It's a 99. Beautiful mother load triple patch. Oh, at least two color pieces. 
And then, wow, another Kadeem carry. Wow, Panini falling asleep at the wheel. He might all take it, though. This is the base one to 199 rookie autograph. The shield and the 199. I'll tell you who doesn't have an O-line is uh, Seattle. Oh, their offensive line is absolutely hard. Yeah, you say, yeah, Denver may be rock solid on offensive lines, but do you know who your quarterback is? Butt fumble. Uh, he, he doesn't matter if he has a good offensive line. He'll screw up one way or the other. Doesn't take much for butt fumble. Just give him time. You, you'll learn to hate him such as I did as an Eagles fan. And I still feel sorry for you Niners fans. Things aren't looking good in uh, San Francisco. Carlos Hyde, do not draft him this year if you're doing fantasy. If you saw anything that happened with any of the Eagles running backs last year under Chip Kelly, you would stay far, far, far away. All right, guys, here in a minute we'll do a mini helmet. Followed by a baseball jersey, the basketball jersey, the 09 black. Last one we get to do. Hit Parade 7 football jersey, some prime sigs, a game day greats football jersey, the tops diamond, and then the full size helmet, which still has a few teams to go on it. Oh, a nice break of black gold, one of one. Never argue with that. Let's do our first memorabilia break. And three defensive backs to replace Woodson. Yeah, that sounds about right. All right. Got C Panther Power up top. Welcome to us with the Cardinals. Diggity Deals, TW Devin, Mad Mike. Panther Power with the Panthers. Pet and Kel, Diggity Deals, Dallas. Drewski, Raging. P. Michael, Squash A. Upstate. Tommy Chapin, Janaconda, Rock Rule, P. Michael, Wyatt, Skywalker. John and Cam, 1, 2, 3P, Winter Soldier, 32, TDP and Priacaville. I'm telling you, I, I, don't get me wrong, I like that. I don't really, I don't really hate any team in that division except for the Chargers. I'm not a Chargers fan in the least bit, but yeah, I still think it's, it's up for shots. Anybody has a chance in that division except for probably San Diego. I mean, they didn't do bad drafting. They got some good skill position players, too. I mean, Melvin Gordon could kick it up this year. Ladarius Green taking over for um, Antonio Gates eventually. Keenan Allen's a great wide out. So offensively, not bad. I just, I just don't think they'll ever get it together. All the years where they had decent players and could never do anything. I mean, you had LT and you couldn't do anything. Oh, no, I fully agree, Ryan. He's definitely, butt fumbles in the best opportunity he can be in, but he'll probably still fail. Because when he even played with Philly, he had some good wide outs in Macklin. He had Deshaun, I believe, was still on the team when he came over there. Nah, well, no, actually, you think about it. I, you're not getting the keys handed to you in Denver. For the simple fact, yeah, you have Emmanuel Sanders. Yes, you have Demarius Thomas. Your running backs haven't lived up to their full potential. I mean, it's not a bad timeshare, but neither of them are great. Uh, you lost a decent tight end in, um, in Julius Thomas. More of a big wide out than a tight end, but still. The Night of Hol uh, Honolulu Blue Kool-Aid. i got to know what that is. That sounds interesting.
I don't know. I kind of, I got kind of agree with the Broncos guys there. Manning was not the offense last year. Manning kind of was a horrible joke last year. Oh yeah, we got nicknames for everybody. Like old rehab on the front of the box right here. One pack per box, guys. Two hits, a booklet hit, and another hit of some sort. Sometimes you will get two booklets. Can actually even pull legend autos out of this set. We'll start out with a Jared Aberdeus for the pack. Raging 52. Bobby, are you in Hana? Are you are you actually in Hawaii? Because we got a few people to buy with us in Hawaii. 20 of 20. Great low number rookie auto. Followed by old Sammy. This guy's in for another big season. Mad Mike M1A to 199. Yeah, Manning did break records last year, but it wasn't in typical Manning fashion. It was just accumulated numbers over the years. And given that, though, he did break them. And he retired as one of the best ever to play the game, but he just was not himself. Oh, yeah, broke jaw? Yeah. How can you be a quarterback and let another player break your face? There goes your leadership right out the door. All right, you can get everything from, uh, with these mini helmets. You can get everything from an upsize to a Barry Sanders autograph seat. Speaking of the lines, uh, the upsizes are very difficult to get, guys. I mean, considering what they offer in the upsize tickets, they are rare. Or touchdown treasures, they call them now. I always call them upsizes. Gino should get a chance. Man, Gino's had a few chances. Uh, I think, if anything, i like to see what Bryce Petty can do for the Jets. I hope the Jets have a great season. I hope Matt Forte murders it over there after taking, carrying Chicago on its back for so many years and then getting kicked out the city pretty much for Jeremy Langford. How can you have a teammate that stupid? Ask any Bengals fan with Vontez Perfect or uh, Adam Pacman Jones. I'm sure they can answer that question. All right, who will we see out of this one? Hey, they didn't stick the thing right up on top on me. Looks like it's going to be a Colt. It's going to be an old school Colt, too. Oh, there's one I've never. I don't think we ever pulled. Have we ever pulled an Art Donovan before? I mean, Art Donovan. Died recently, too. No longer with us. 8-4-2013. 50s All-Deck 18. Five-time All-Pro. Four-time. Or five-time Pro Bowl. Four-time All-Pro. Two-time NFL champion Baltimore. Baltimore retired. It is Indy, though. It is not the Baltimore. It is, does not go to the Ravens. Hall of Fame in 68. The Baltimore Colts turned into the Indianapolis Colts. It was an old-school player, too. Old-school hit on an Art Donovan. We always go by franchise, guys. We don't go by city. We've always done that in two years we have been breaking. It's always franchise, never city. So if you pull a Houston Oiler, it goes to the Tennessee Titans. If you pull a Baltimore Colt, it goes to the Indianapolis Colts. That is old school. Art Donovan, that is a great hit. I think he retired. I think he was retired before the Super Bowl even came into existence. There's your certification. No upsize. Awesome hit. One, two, three, P. Pac Man is a thug. I agree. He, he is garbage. He has talent, just doesn't know how to use it properly. And perfect, man. After that shot on Antonio Brown, I don't. I'll never have respect for that guy. That was cheap as cheap comes. Trying to knock out the best wide out in the game because you guys can't stop him. It's not how you play the game. Alright guys, got a few more breaks to come still. 
Still got a few teams left on the full-size helmet. We'll get to that in a minute. Maybe one second, guys. We'll move to the next break, which will be a baseball jersey. Yeah, first game day, great shirts we did tonight pulled us a yielded us a Drew Brees. Yeah, we've been on a roll this evening, but the best hit to me still was Steeler Gal Steeler Gal when you got that uh, Eli Manning Big Ben uh, Drew Brees triple autograph to five out of ten limited. First break of ten limited, we do that's what we pull. Number ones have always been good to us. Number ones have always done us well. I mean, we got that Topps Diamond to end a little while ago as well. Topps Diamond Collection. People were dying for this set. It was supposed to come out like mid December or towards the end of December. Did not end up getting released till March. Had to wait forever for it to come out. But, man, it's been well worth it with some of the cards we have pulled out of here. I mean, insane hits. Bunch of one-of-ones we've seen. Some awesome rookie autographs. Some awesome legend autographs. But, yeah, guys, if you want to get in a break before the night's over with, check out the last few teams on the full-size helmet is the last auction we have ending this evening. Uh, right now, guys, let's do a baseball jersey. Well, Dale Murphy as a Brave at the last one. Yeah, I was surprised he got back in the league, too. Yeah, but the reason I said that Baltimore Colts thing, because a, a lot of people have asked, do the Colts, I've had many messages about that. Do the Colts, do the Baltimore Colts go to the Ravens? No, it's never going to be like that. I mean, that's with any, it goes by franchise. It'll always go by franchise. If he went by city, that'd be pretty bad. It could, it could bring up some bad instances. <laughs> because do any of you think of Johnny Unitas as a Raven? No, not at all. All right, guys, hit Prairie Series 5 baseball jersey with some 15 Supreme number 17. P. Michael Vargara, good to see you, sir. Red Sox for life, Tobin Hedgelin. Oh, P. Michael, we came across some more 12 SP Signature Series next week, too. That set's done you well. I'm still jealous over that quad auto you got of the, uh, of the San Francisco Giants. I think I, I think I even offered you a whole box of 12 Signature Edition for that, and you still wouldn't give it up. I understand, though. Giants fan. Winter Soldier, Fury 9, Rock Rule, Bats, P. Michael, Sancho, Red Sox. Oh, Tobin Hedgelin. I actually uh, want to bring that up to you. Uh, Call Dill, were you not trying to get rid of, uh, sell or trade a Dan Marino autograph jersey? I know, Tobin, you are a... Uh, I know you're a Dolphins fan. Oh, that's cheap. Oh, that's cheap. That is wrong. So the guy said because it was the Houston Texans, or the Houston Oilers, it went to the Texans, and then they housed it because, what, they kept the Texans? That's wrong. At that point, you just give it up to the Titans anyway, because if you're housing it, you might as well just give it to the people in your breaks. I mean, there's been times, I mean, there's times we keep the Eagles and the Vikings, for example. And we'll do a card break, and we'll get a random or something like that. And I'll be in a random, or Robbie will be in a random. And we win the random. There's been times where I've randomized it again, so I made sure I didn't get it. There's been times where we just gave it to who the other person was. It was just a two-player random. That Yeah, that's crappy. Ooh, that's crappy. I don't badmouth breakers. There are plenty of bad ones out there, but I'll never say who they are. You guys, I'm sorry. That's something you guys got to figure out yourself. I've never been one to badmouth another breaker. Uh, it's just, 
it's not it's not what you do it's not what you do you don't do that let those people make it you know screw themselves up you don't need to bad mouth them I, I, at least I never do. You guys can all you want. Doesn't bother me at all. At least I'll know then, too. But yeah, you always go by franchise. Never do you go by city. I mean, any breaker I've ever seen has gone by franchise. I mean, everyone can do it their own way. It is their own breaks. It is up to them in the end of it anyway. But still, yeah, that's pretty grimy. And we pulled many Earl Campbells. So you send Warren Moon to the Texans? I guess that breaker didn't know that when uh, the Oilers moved to Tennessee, for the first season they still wore the Oilers jerseys. Yeah, I know. I mean, if any of you guys remember that, when you first saw Eddie George, he was in an Oilers jersey. Mikel Franco for the Phillies to start it off. It's two autographs per box. Bats. And then a James Shields, nice veteran auto for the San Diego Padres, Heary 9. Yeah, it just makes no sense to me. I mean, if you really wanted to get technical, I've thought about this one in the past. If you pulled an old Browns hit, should it go to the Ravens? No, that, that's like the exception. Because remember, Cleveland disappeared for a couple years and went to Baltimore and then the Browns came back. But still, that's the one exception where we'll always go to the Browns. Paid the most for the break, got the card? Oh, God, no. Wow, okay, there are some bad breaking experiences I haven't seen before. Yikes. That's horrible. All right, guys, on to it. Oh, grabbed the wrong one. They're both blue. That was my mistake. Baseball. Let's not break a football jersey. On to a Hit Parade Series 5 baseball jersey. Again, Hit Parade, as always, is it a card world product. If you are new to Hit Parade, you can always find uh, anything about Hit Parade um, on the Card World's website. It's right on the top left tab of their home page. Yeah, I mean, you think about that. Browns, Ravens, Browns. But, again, to keep things fair and right, Browns will be Browns. There's no Browns going to Ravens or no stupid stuff like that. But, I mean, just think about it. It did happen. But Houston Texans for the Oilers? No. That'd be like pulling a Raiders hit from L.A. and sending them to the Rams. Well, that wouldn't be that bad, but, you know. I mean, that's basically what it turns into if you're going by city. If it says L.A. Raiders, I guess it has to go to the Rams. Or the Chargers. Sure, there's a few other instances you can do it. If you actually think back far enough to where some of these teams have played in the past. All right. What will we have this time? <gasps> Ooh! Oh, it's a big boom. Big, big, big boom. That is definitely an Ozzy Smith. No question about it. Ozzy Smith autograph jersey. Now, let's see if it's going to be a custom. I always try to check these. Is Dave and Adam certified? If it'll be a custom or not. I think it is majestic. Yes, it will be a Cooperstown collection jersey on Ozzy Smith. Awesome hit TX Sancho with St. Louis. Ozzy Smith. You know you can actually pull him as a Padre too, I believe. <clears throat> yeah, you're right. It, yeah, again, think about that. If you sent a Brown to the Ravens. That, that's just like a curse upon a curse because you're sending him to your division rival. Yeah, a Jim Brown. Think about that going to the Ravens. That would make absolutely no sense whatsoever. Awesome hit on an Ozzie Smith.
All right, guys, I think that's going to be it for auctions for the night. Uh, finish up the full-size helmet. And right now, we will move on to a Hit Parade Series 6 basketball jersey with some 13-14 timeless number 9. And last one of these, we did pull a John Wall for the Wizards. Um, All-Star jersey. Guy actually called it. He called it. He said, pull me a John Wall. And we pulled a John Wall. People call him here and there. Schultz did call Jim Kelly a couple weeks ago. Um... Uh, we had the Julius Irving that got called. There's been people have called some hits before. I mean, it's pure luck, of course. But hey, it always never hurts to try. Like Chat said that one time, Schultz don't leave. You got to see my Jim Kelly full size helmet. And it ended up being a Jim Kelly full size helmet. The Paris Wheel P. Michael Bryakaville. I think somebody actually called a far one time, too. 04 Go Pack, Smack Mouth Aussie. Red Sox, Skywalker, Cawville, Chris RDKOH, and Red Sox on the bottom. Yeah, it looks like the storm finally passed us, guys. We got hit by a big, big, uh, big couple swells earlier. Uh, actually, knocked the power out for about uh, about ten seconds. We actually had just started our first break video. I was going through the list of the first break, and boom, got knocked out. Power smacked the crap out of us. You have a. I know we pulled you the cream autograph, right? Out of timeless. Pulled a Carl Malone the last break of this, I believe we did, along with that John Wall. All right, guys, one pack per box. As always, you get three hits. Start with old Timeless Team Scotty. Great player. Ray Allen, getting a little old to still be around, but hey, <clears throat> still trying. Contavious Caldwell Pope for the Pistons. Upstate Treasures, that is you, or Stone Stash. Treasure Picks. Got a Justin Hamilton for the Miami Heat. D4B1A2. Validating Mark's Auto. And a CJ Malcolm. Rookie two color patch, clear cut auto to 49. Nice hit for the Trailblazers. Hall CCA bats. All right, guys, on to a basketball jersey. Got some 09 black after that. And a Hit Parade Series 7 football jersey. Yeah, a Stalin Ronaldo jersey. Yeah, it wasn't a good day for him. What did you say earlier? He tore a ligament? I didn't release it now. <laughs> Oh, what do we have? Well, I'm guessing that's a piston, and if that's Is that a Chauncey Billups, I think that's a Chauncey Billups. That's a Chauncey Billups for the Pistons. Part of that great team back in the early 2000s with him, Richard Hamilton, uh, Wallace, and a few others. When they were actually knocking out the playoffs pretty well back in the day. I sit on a Chauncey Billups. I haven't seen his autograph ever. Adidas jersey to boot. It is not a custom. PSA DNA certified. Oh, you didn't see that? Yeah, Ronaldo went down. You guys need that. Eight minutes and 25 minutes he finally left the game. And they still pulled it out in overtime. Or in sudden death. Yeah, he got injured. Yeah, man. No, I'm serious. Yeah, it happened. I'm not a big soccer guy. I just happened to scroll across it earlier. 
Yeah, nice hit on a Chauncey Billups. That's cool. Upstate Treasures. All right, guys. Uh, moving on. We got some. This is the set I love to do. <clears throat> Again, there is no card in this set worth under $12. Not a card. We're about to do here. Um. 09 Upper Deck Black. It's probably the last one we get to do. It's hard to come across this set. I mean, first time we broke it was probably well, well over a year ago. It's been a long time since we broke it. Until the past couple of weeks, we actually be able to break two. This will be the third one we get to do. This again, guys, ended tonight on eBay, West Virginia. Dem pitch. Dallas P. Michael. This price with the Bengals. Crow 74. Caudill. Dem pitch. 04 go pack. West Virginia. Unheard of 28 with the Rams, John and Cam. Mardish. Janaconda, Steeler Gal, Core Balking 6, Snyder, CSTI, P. Michael, and CSTI. <clears throat> you can tell this box was sitting in, sitting in someone's storage for a minute before we bought it. It's actually got dust on top of the on the box. <laughs> you don't see off. That means this 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 box has been hanging out waiting to be broke. It's been dusted. So it won't have been broke forever. Alright guys, it is two mini boxes per box. Each mini box contains a pack. Tells an old box. This thing's been sitting there for a long time. Wow. Best hit of 09 rookie wise? Eh, it's a toss up. I mean, you got some everything from Shady's, uh, well, Stafford's rookie year, but I don't consider him great. Uh, Clay Matthews. Actually, I have to look into. We don't do a lot of nine stuff. We do here and there. We've done 09 triple threads and 09 black recently. That's the only ones we've done. 09 is expensive, oddly enough. It's Butt Fumble's rookie year. I'll tell you that. All right, guys. Uh, two mini box or pack number one. Actually, it's a mini box within a pack. See we can pull out of here. We will start off. Oh, here you go with a Rocky Blyer to 250. American flag patch for the Steelers. Steeler gal to 250. Nice. I'm sure you appreciate that. And uh, I don't know much about this guy. Ramsey's Barton. Oh, he is a giant. I remember him. We've actually seen him at 09 Triple Threads. Mar Dish. Being on card rookie autograph to 399. We pulled some great legends out of here. But the last three breaks we've done, the first six breaks we did was nothing but monster hits. The last three have been a lot of rookie hits. Before that, it was all like legend and veteran hits we were pulling. Let's see if this one can step it up a notch. Oh, how about a Don Maynard? Another old schooler American flag to 250 for the Jets. Jana Khan. The guys, remember, there's no card in this set worth under $12. I don't care who it is. Oh, yeah, there's a good one. How about a Malcolm Jenkins? Now an Eagle. Great safety. 
for the Saints, John and Cam. On-card rookie autograph. Another good safety to come out of that uh, draft class. Nice hit. Yeah, actually, Philly looks like they have a couple of safeties now with Jenkins and, uh, gosh, I can't remember, forget the last guy's name. But they've done pretty well all in all. But again, I mean, of course they're going to do well when your front course is so horrible, your secondary has to get most of the tackles. I guess that's not a good thing. When your safeties have more tackles than your linebackers, that's not usually a very good sign. Not in the least bit. Hey, I, Mark Sanchez could pull a deal for it. It wouldn't surprise me. It can happen. I mean, look, Flacco won a championship. And I don't care what you say. Flacco is not a great QB. You can argue with me all you want. He's not. Caleb Big, he's overpaid. Travis, Winter Soldier, Deer Slayer, P. Michael, Ragin, ND for Life, Call Deal with the Broncos, Skywalker with the Lions, Winter Soldier, Z. Paul, Travis, Crow 74 with my Eagles, and P. Michael with Robbie's Vikings, Schultz with the Niners, Ray Din R, and J.F. Kilgore. Hope all is well, Schultz. Every game with Maynard as a jet. I tell you, a lot of you guys that appreciate old school autographs would definitely appreciate Lee Fink. It's a set we don't very get to do anymore, but man, we did it. The hits we pulled out of there. I mean, we pulled Jerry Rice rookie autographed cards, like rookie autographs of Jerry Rice. Rookie autographs is Troy Aikman. There's many others in there, too. It was a limited set is what it was. I think they only made 60 cases total with Leaf Inc. Pulled Don Shula autos, many other things. All right, guys, 13 Supreme. Pack per box. With Supreme, this set has pulled us some monsters, man. Oh, my lord. Uh, P. Michael, didn't we pull you a one of one Bo Jackson out of here? Thought we did. Pretty sure we did. All right, how about we start with old Richard Sherman to 170? Pulled his auto to 10 out of 14 limited the other night. Another cool breeze sighting. This one will be to 50. J.J. Watt with a salute to 75. And a Kembrill Tompkins rookie autograph to 75 for the Patriots. Z. Paul, 197.705. Yeah, sometimes you'll get a one-of-one one Drew Brees like we saw the other day. And every once in a while you'll get a Kembrill Tompkins. Seventy? Are you, wow! I didn't know it was that many. I know you got a ton the last time you broke with us. You you took home you took home the championship last time you broke with us. I mean that was the most I've ever seen anyone get. Period. All right, guys. Hit parade series seven. Again, it is at a Card World product. If you are new to it, you can find any information you need at thecardworld.com. They are 100 uh, set runs, like each series is 100, 100 boxes. Number 36 of 100, the buses number. Oh, we pulled some Seahawk jerseys now. Whew. 
pulled a couple of Largents. I think we pulled a Russell Wilson once as well. I even pulled a Golden Tate jersey one time. All right, who do we get this time? I know that autograph anywhere. R. Palmer. That's going to be a DeAndre Hopkins. I guarantee it. Just by the, the way the auto looks, and it's number 10, and it is red. That's definitely a Hopkins. I'll stick that certification away from the auto. Dave and Adam certified. DeAndre Hopkins autograph always takes up the entire one. I mean, when he signs, he truly signs a jersey. Definitely De DeAndre, though it is kind of covered up here. Let's see if I can actually get it to you here so you can see it. But it's definitely DeAndre Hopkins. There's no question about it. Let's see if it actually says it on the cert. Now, it's TriStar certified as well, but that is definitely DeAndre Hopkins. I will I'll show you guys because it doesn't say a name. I always want to show just so you guys are 100% with me on this. Definitely DeAndre Hopkins. Nice hit on DeAndre Hopkins. He'll be a beast this year. He actually may have a quarterback for the first time in his career as well. With old Brock Osweiler. Let's see how that works out. That's either going to be a slam dunk for Houston or a lot of wasted money. But Brock Osweiler has the bill to be a great quarterback. He's like, what, 6'6"? Six, six? He's a huge dude. He might actually be like more like 6'8", if correct. He's a big boy. You know, I'm up for most Eagles trades, but not DeMarco Murray. Uh, he's To me, he really was never an Eagle. He was an Eagle for one season, and he did absolutely horrible. Most other players, Eagle-wise, uh, shoot me all the trades you want. Uh, anything Vikings, Robbie's always interested in. I'm always interested in the Houston Rockets, San Francisco Giants, New York Mets. So a lot of different things, guys. We're always up for trades. We got a lot. We got a heck of a collection as well, fellas. So if you're ever looking for anything, always shoot us a message. We may have something uh, hanging around. You never know. All right, guys. On to eleven prime signatures. This is a five box break number sixty-seven. This set here has pulled us everything from. Joe Montana autos to Brett Favre autos. I mean, everything to Joe Namus. I mean, uh, there is a great, great, great draft class. The legend autos in here are very deep. I mean, there is everything from Mean Joe Green to Ed Too Tall Jones to guys from before pretty much any of our time. I don't care if you've been watching football since the 60s. There's guys from before that time. It, it goes way back with some of the autos in this set. Rodney's Gem, Schultz with the Falcons looking for old Julio. Marcem, Bo Jackson fan looking for a Cam rookie. Art Palmer going for a Beaker, a.k.a. Andy Dalton. Or an A.J. Green. Or a.k.a. Red Rider BB Gun. Rob Weem, Swill, Impact Electronics. There's also the Bills starting QB's rookie year. I think he is a Raven in his rookie year. Steve Stelzy, 123P, Rodney's Gem, Swill, P. Michael, and Swill. What, Ryan, Julio Jones jerseys? I know we pulled a few. I know we pulled a few mini helmets. I know we pulled a few jerseys on Julio as well. All right, guys. One pack per box. You get one, one autograph per box. A lot of them are on card. You get two base cards and usually a prime proof parallel. Let's 
Seattle, most Seattle fans don't have anything Seattle. They haven't been fans long enough. I can believe that. Ronaldo will sell for a ton, I bet. Alright, let's get it going with an Austin Collie to four ninety nine. Followed by Mean Joe Green. Most of these guys you see, if you see a legend card, their auto is in this set as well. Oh, I'm not even saying that name. We're just going to pass right by. It's to 99 for the Bucks. And then an Anthony Allen rookie autograph to 25 for the Ravens. Rodney's Gems. Nice low number auto to start off. Though Josh Freeman actually got the start last year. He played for the Colts towards the end of the season. Guys, box number two. Still got a TriStar Game Day Greats jersey. The diamond and the full size helmet after this. Start with a Franco Harris to $4.99. Chad Henney, $4.99. A prime proof of Darren Woodson to $49 for the Cry Boys. One, two, three, P. Here's an interesting combo. Two of five. Colt McCoy, Jamal Charles. Brownies is Crow. Chiefs is Impact Electronics. We will random that at the end. Two of five. Signing bonus. Uh, signing bonus. I guess they both got signed this year. And I'm not sure what the combination between these two is. Let's see if it says something on the back. Oh, they played together for the Longhorns. Played together in college. I still think Colt McGoy has talent. No one's ever used him properly. Oh, that's sweet, Anthony. Hey, that is one autograph we've come across um, a lot is uh, Griffey, and that's always been in 2012 SP Signature Edition Baseball. We've come across Griffey's with Jeter's, Griffey's by themselves, Griffey Father Sons, Griffey with Schilling, Randy Johnson, and Tino Martinez. Uh, we've, it's been a lot of uh, Griffey's out of that one set. Yeah, I don't think a Julio Jones is worth an Elway either, I gotta say. 499, Dwayne Bow. Cool Breeze. Klecko to 99, old schooler for the Jets. And an Armand Smith rookie autograph for the Brownies. Crow 74 US. Tomlinson's a good one to have, though. Still holds that record for most touchdowns in a season. Uh, pretty much any autograph of Griffey we've pulled out of that 12 signature edition has been a Mariner. I don't think I've ever come across one that goes to Cincy. I mean, there may be one in there. I've just never seen it. Alright, got a Ed Too Tall Jones. I've seen his auto in here as well. Chris Carter, $4.99. Ben Tate to $49. And a Vincent Brown on card rookie autograph to $249 for the Chargers. Rodney's Gems. Well, number to five, dual auto's been the biggest hit out of this break so far. No legend yet. Usually we see at least one legend auto, but every once in a while you do not. But a nice with Jamal, Charles, and McCoy together, especially since it's number to five. Let's 
So we can end it off with got a Lenny Moore to 499. Casper. It's uh, one of uh old lefties go to guys back in the day. Steve Smith to 99. And how about a Rod Woodson auto to 49? I tell you almost every time. One, two, three P with the Steelers. Do we get a legend autograph out of a five box break? It almost never fails. Great hit on a Rod Woodson P. Michael. All right, guys, got to do a random really fast as well. Give me a moment to get it set up. Very nice. Dual auto of Colt McCoy and Jamal Charles, old college teammates, number two of five. Very, very low, low number hit. All right, with the Brownies, we always go top, bottom, left, or right. Top will be the Browns, bottom will be the Chiefs to start off the random. So with the Brownies, we got Crow 74 US. And with the Chiefs and a Jamal Charles Impact Electronics. All right, fellas, to random.org, we will take it as always. If you are new to randoms with us, I'm not sure if either of you guys have ever done a random with us. We do use random.org's list randomizer. It explains how it works right here. It allows you to arrange the items of a list into a random order. It comes from atmospheric noise, blah, 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 blah. This is getting a little technical there. Talking about algorithms and things like that. Five times, guys. Name of the top of the end of five. We'll get it. <clears throat> Here we go. That is one, two. They are time stamped, and you can see how many times we random it as well. Three, four. Last fifth time is the charm. Five. Crow 74 U.S. Awesome. Hit with the Brownies. And the Colt McCoy is what you want it with. Two of five. Nice hit. Alright guys, up next we'll do a TriStar Game Day Greats jersey here in a moment. And we have some diamond collection and as always guys we'll end with a full size helmet. That just ended about 30 minutes ago. <clears throat> All right, on to a TriStar Game Day Greats jersey with some 14 playbook. You did see a Drew Brees come out of here earlier today out of our, from our 7 o'clock video from Friday. And pull a Frank the Tank Gore after that. So let's see what this one will bring us. Great quarterback and a great running back we've seen tonight. <clears throat> Winter Soldier P. Michael DMP. <clears throat> Raging R. Green 14-14, I believe, welcome to us. P. Michael R. Palmer, Winter Soldier. <clears throat> Raging and R. Green, 14 14. <clears throat> oh, excuse me, guys, getting a little force in the throat towards the end of the break night. <clears throat> oh, Gotta get it out of my system, I guess. All right, guys. P. Michael, was the magic you got, was it a Lakers or an All-Star? Yeah, Carl Anthony Towns was um, was Adidas.
14 playbook, guys. Two hits per box. Get a booklet hit and another hit of some sort. Got a Taj Boyd to start off for the Jets. One, two, three, P. This will be a rookie X's and O's to 99. And a Teddy B for Minnesota to 299. One, two, three, P. This will be a rookie autographs dual patch booklet. Nice hit on old Teddy B. Robbie's praying he has a good season this year and doesn't get knocked out again. Oh, that was great. That one night when uh, yeah, we pulled the two bird jerseys, we pulled the one bird stat jersey, and then we pulled another bird Adidas jersey. All right, guys, game day. Great try, star jersey. Already seen a Drew Brees out of here tonight. There's even a Walter Payton hanging around somewhere. There are no upsize tickets in jerseys. If you're going to get an upsize ticket, it'll be a Walter Payton or a Tom Brady or something like that. And we got a Heisman Trophy winner and a great, great old school Packer and Paul Horning. 56 Heisman Trophy winner, 61 NFL MVP, four-time champion, first Super Bowl champ, 60s All-Decade Team, Packers Hall of Fame, College Football Hall of Fame, Pro Football Hall of Fame. One, two, three, P. Michael. Nice Paul Horning autograph. Hall of Fame 86 inscribed. Seen some nice Paul Hornings in the day. Pulled his college helmets, a few of his jerseys. Great, great old school Packer. Love to see like a Bart Starr Paul Horning dual auto. That would be something else. <clears throat> oh yeah, both in a frame with Magic and Bird. Yeah, we were talking about that. Uh, who has? An all-star magic jersey. Oh, um, either M. Puckett or Tobin Hedgelin had an all-star magic jersey. They want to trade for a Lakers magic jersey so they can do that to get the bird and the magic in the same frame. Lakers, a uh, true Lakers jersey, not the all-star version, and then the bird. All right, guys, 15 Tops Diamond Collection. This will be number 11, guys. This ended again Sunday, just a short while ago. I got Suave up top, West Virginia, Rick Allen, Schultz, John and Cam, Chris Gimble, Hernandez. One, two, three, P, Clapper. Back again with the Broncos, TX Sancho, Gustang. Gustang, welcome back. I don't think we've seen you in forever. Uh, Gresh Price, Goody, or Goo Dotty. Schultz, Gresh Price, Steeler Gal, Dallas, Goody, Dallas, and RG Green, 14-14. Oh, P. Michael, I believe it's custom. I'm sorry, I didn't see your, uh, your message until after I put it up. On the horning. I believe it is. From the looks of it, it is a custom. Could be wrong. Schultz, perfect timing. That is absolutely perfect timing, man. Custom. Custom, yeah. Oh, he got sniped. Oh, well. Unfortunately, Clapper, that's eBay. That is eBay. Thank God they don't have eBay countdown anymore. That's how I used to get sniped all the time myself. With Diamond, guys, it is one pack per box. You get three on-card autos. It is an amazing set by Tops. We have pulled some monstrous hits out of here. Let's see what we can get tonight. 
Well, good way to start when you pull a Warren Moon Auto to 10. Awesome hit. Again, Oilers is always Titans. That'll be Dallas 1369 with a Warren Moon on card silver signing auto, 9 of 10. And if you ever get a Warren Moon, Warren Moon jersey number, you get the you get the first of the print run and the jersey number. Behind that, this guy, I still think will have a great year this year. One of five, TJ Yeldon. Great low number hit. Gresh Price with the Jags. And finally, a diamond autograph patch card redemption of CJ Anderson for the Broncos Clapper. That is you. This will be a different. Usually with these signs, they're different colors. They can be uh, gold. Uh, they can be yellow, they can be silver, they can be all different colors. Awesome hit on a C.J. Anderson. See if he can pick it back up this year. Nice hit, sir. You're a Broncos fan to boot even better. What a war moon to 10 off the bat. Now, C.J. Anderson should be low numbered as well. And a number to 5, T.J. Yeldon. That is sweet. All right, guys, will be the last break of the evening here with a Leaf Autograph full size helmet with some 13 Supreme number 78. Done many full size helmets and have pulled everything from Barry Sanders to Cam Newton's to John Elway's to Marino's. I mean, you name them, we have seen some awesome hits. We got Goody up top, Skywalker, Winter Soldier, P. Michael, John and Cam, Griff DMP, 04 Go Pat, PR Comic Fan. John and Cam, Winter Soldier. Dallas, NJ Pickle Weasel, Mitchie Y. Griff Raging DMP and R Green 1414. Alright, guys, we always do this one with 13 Supreme. Do a lot of breaks to 13 Supreme. It is by far one of the sets that has pulled us some monstrous hits. Still to this date, we pull a lot of one of ones from Andrew Lux to Bo Jackson's to Big Ben's to Dan Marino's. But the biggest one of one we ever pulled was, again, it was West Virginia. God, I'll never forget this one. It was a one of one autographed booklet of Joe Montana. And back in the day, instead of a Nike Swoosh or Reebok logo, you got the Wilson patch. And it was the Wilson patch. As a monstrous hit. There's, a, there's quad autos of old school players. There is so much in Supreme you can get. Looks like our hit will be a redemption in this one. Are they Victor Cruz to 170? Mr. Uh, oh, Collarbone. Busted Collarbone to 50. Andre Ellington, rookie to 99. Let's see what our redemption is going to be. Yeah, not bad. Not great, but not bad. Retired veteran and star autograph blue parallel of Alex Smith for the Chiefs. Winter Soldier, 32. Hey, he stayed in the league for a while. He's never been the greatest quarterback, but he's never been a bad quarterback. He can manage the game. He can not force turnovers. He can get a lot done. He's just never had the strongest arm. All right, guys, on to a full-size helmet. Always let me adjust the camera on these. Always got to get the whole thing in the picture. And we have seen everything from undefeated Dolphins helmets to Montana's, Marinos, Elways, Sanders, Cam Newton, Warren Moon, Jim Kelly's, Lawrence Harris, OBJ's, Jameis Winston's. 
I mean, I'm sure I can keep on going, but that's just a few we've seen over the time we've broke this. Looks like we got a red helmet. Usually they're the black boxes. This will be a red box. This will be a Texas Longhorn. Please don't be a Vinci on I will, I will, I will write Leaf in protest. Oh, who, oh, who will we have? Is that another Earl Campbell? This is like the third Earl Campbell we've seen a couple times as a Titan, a couple times in the Longhorn version. Let's see who had the Titans on that one. Yeah, Earl Campbell, long, long time um, Houston Oiler. I, th I think his, his whole career, though, he played with the Saints towards the end of his career. Heisman Trophy inscribed 77 as well. Nice hit on an Earl Campbell Griff 24. Very nice hit. Some very nice hits this evening. The Drew Brees jersey is probably the best jersey hit we pulled tonight. That was great. Rarely do you ever see a Drew Brees jersey. Guys, that'll be everything from the weekend. Uh, and we have a lot ending over the next few days as well. Be back again on Tuesday the 12th. Black, guys. We will get taken care of. Uh, Tuesday again for delay on that. All right, uh, let's take you to the Right Out Sports really fast, guys. If you are new to our website, here's RightOutSports.com. A few of the hits there's that L way for another day. Call Dale on the way to you. P. Michael, you got that Jerry Rice. Still have that up there. It's a great hit. A few of the hits from last week as well with that Buster Posey we pulled the other day. There's that Richard Sherman. Richard Sherman autos are definitely hard to come by. Again, guys, but over the next two days, we'll be breaking again Tuesday. 13 black, we're going to start out with tomorrow. Some more 10 plates. Inception, uh, Inception football, 5x16 Inception baseball. Again, you're going for prospects. Inception baseball is a great way to go. Got some more 7 limited, some more 15 16 uh, basketball. Of course, another baseball jersey, a game day, great jersey, some nine triple threads. Never sleep on old years of triple threads, guys. They are an amazing set. 13-14 gold standard basketball as well. Another great set. Gold standard is a great one. Pulled a 14 karat gold piece out the last one we did. Got some 16 Trinity as well. If you go and try for some new the uh, some of the newer guys from the NFL draft class in 16. And then Tuesday we start out with some 15 Leaf Trinity. Trinity is my favorite set by Leaf. Got some more 12 black, some 7 upper deck premier, some 14 triple thread, some 16 metal draft, our last one. So guys, both days we got some great 16 sets, some more 11 prime sigs on Tuesday, some more diamond on Tuesday. That was a great break a minute ago. Another basketball jersey, some 14 Spectre as well on Tuesday, and again, another full-size helmet. Guys, anytime you need any information, you can always find our schedule here. It is up through next Thursday for anything you may need. See what we're doing throughout the next week and a half. Yeah, I thought about that when you guys were talking about trades. I didn't want to bring up that, uh, that Jim Brown, but yeah. Yeah, that that'd be one I wouldn't want to get rid of either. All right, guys, I, we appreciate it as always. You have a great evening. If you need anything, shoot us a message. Just check us out Monday and Tuesday. We'll be breaking again Tuesday starting at 9 Eastern time. 
You guys have a great night. This should be processed to YouTube here in the next couple of minutes, guys, and we'll see you at 9 p.m. the day after tomorrow.